Single crystal turbine blades are unique components that are made from a single, continuous piece of metal without any internal boundaries. Consequently, they are significantly more resilient to heat and stress than conventional blades. Manufacturers employ a process known as directional solidification to produce these blades. This process involves the gradual cooling and controlled solidification of molten metal, resulting in the formation of a single crystal throughout the blade. The Bridgman method is frequently employed to achieve this. In this method, the metal is poured into a ceramic mold and subsequently transferred from a heated to a cold environment, thereby enabling the crystal to grow from a small seed at the base to the blade. This unique structure enables the blades to endure the harsh conditions within aircraft engines, thereby enhancing their efficiency and extending their lifespan. Directional solidification is a cutting-edge manufacturing process that has become indispensable in the development of highly efficient turbine blades for aircraft engines. This technology is particularly noteworthy in Russia, where United Engine Corporation, UEC, employs it to manufacture single crystal turbine blades for their most recent engines, including the PD-14 and PD-8, which are powering Russia's new generation of passenger aircraft. The procedure commences with the creation of a ceramic mold, which is frequently fashioned around a wax model of the blade. The mold is subsequently heated and a nickel-based superalloy that has been specially formulated is melted and injected into it. A single crystal seed is positioned at the mold's base. The mold, which is filled with molten metal, is gradually transferred from the heated zone of the furnace to the cold zone in a controlled manner. The single crystal structure commences to expand from the seed upward as the metal cools and solidifies, resulting in a blade with a continuous, defect-free crystal lattice. The mold is immersed in a bath of liquid aluminum as it exits the heated zone at UEC Saturn, where an innovative high-speed directional solidification technique is employed. This rapid cooling enhances the structural properties of the completed blade and provides even more control over the crystallization process. The limitations of earlier manufacturing methods are the primary reason for the adoption of directional solidification. Turbine blades were stamped from metal in the 1950s and prior, which restricted the types of alloys that could be employed and the blade's capacity to withstand high temperatures. The development of new, heat-resistant alloys that could not be stamped was necessary as the temperature of gases entering the turbine increased as jet engines became more potent. The subsequent innovation was the development of casting, which enabled the use of these sophisticated alloys. Nevertheless, the structure of cast blades contained numerous grains, which could lead to weak points when subjected to the high temperatures and extreme centrifugal forces of a jet engine. By aligning the granules in the direction of mechanical load, directional solidification mitigates the risk of fatigue and failure. The most significant development was the creation of single crystal blades, which are the most durable and robust turbine blades available. These blades are capable of withstanding temperatures exceeding 2000 Kelvin and lack any grain boundaries. Directional solidification and single crystal blade technology are used globally, although Russia has developed its own distinctive approach. The United States was a pioneer in this field, as corporations such as General Electric and Pratt & Whitney refined the Bridgman process for the growth of single crystal blades in vacuum casting furnaces. These blades are employed in both military and commercial engines and are composed of sophisticated superalloys, which may include rare elements such as rhenium. In Europe, manufacturers such as Rolls-Royce in the UK and Safran in France also utilize directional solidification and have implemented innovations such as gas cooling casting, which utilizes inert gas to expedite solidification and enhance the microstructure of the blades. To enhance the performance of their engines, European companies are perpetually developing new ceramic mold technologies and super alloys. China has made substantial strides in the production of single crystal blades, with both state-owned and private companies capable of mass-producing these components for advanced military and civilian engines.
The disparity with Western standards is rapidly closing, although quality control remains an ongoing focus. India has also developed indigenous single crystal blade technology, predominantly for military engine programs, using variants of the Bridgman process to support its aerospace ambitions. In Germany, research institutes and industrial collaborators have developed autonomous directional solidification processes that facilitate the rapid and high-quality production of single crystal blades for both aerospace and power generation applications. Directional solidification and single crystal blade technology are used extensively on a global scale. UEC and its subsidiaries employ it in Russia for the PD-14 and PD-8 engines. In the United States, Pratt & Whitney, General Electric, and Honeywell are the industry leaders. Rolls-Royce, Safran, and MTU Aero Engines are the most prominent aerospace companies in Europe, while AECC and other Chinese companies have made significant strides. Germany's technical institutions and industrial partners contribute to both aerospace and stationary gas turbine applications, while India's Defense Research and Development Organization and related enterprises have also achieved success. In conclusion, the fabrication of turbine blades worldwide has been transformed by the implementation of directional solidification and single crystal casting. The Bridgman process and its variants are being further refined by the United States and Europe, while Russia's UEC implements high-speed cooling techniques. This critical technology has become a fundamental component of contemporary engine design as a result of the development of its own capabilities by China and India. The outcome is a new generation of jet engines that are capable of delivering extraordinary performance, durability, and efficiency, and are used to power a wide range of aircraft, including commercial airliners and state-of-the-art fighter jets. Now, which nation do you think has the most advanced single crystal turbine blade manufacturing? Let us know in the comments. Please feel free to like, share, and subscribe to our channel.